available the first week of February. For those of you new watching today, my name is Summer and I am a reseller on the app Poshmark, Macari, eBay, a little bit on Facebook Marketplace. Um, I'm going to try to do one of these videos once a week if I have enough sales. Um, it's been a little slow for me lately since October of last year actually when I had knee surgery. Um, as you can tell, I'm still on crutches. It's been a little rough. Um, I haven't been able to list like I should. Um, hadn't been able to shop like I want to. Been having to do a lot of my shopping online. So it's been really tough for me. So I've been spending a lot of my time um, learning eBay new to that um, if anyone has any tips on how to get that going I appreciate it um, I've been spending a lot of my time relisting some old stuff on Poshmark been moving some old inventory that way so that's kind of how I've been keeping my sales going since I've been down um, it's probably going to be this way for a while because I might have to have another knee surgery um, it's a very long story. I might tell my story one day about that. Um, long story short, the very first surgeon that did surgery on my knee last March um, screwed up and messed some things up. So, but that's another another story for another day. So, anyways, so this is a little behind. This is going to be the first week of February. It's actually January thirty first through February the sixth. So let's get started. So the very first thing, let me scoot over so I can put some stuff up here on the screen. The very first thing was on January the 31st and it was this, um, this sells on Poshmark and this was a six piece sample um, set of face lotion, face mask, wrinkle cream. Um, I had a Ipsy subscription and these were some things in my subscription that I either couldn't use or didn't want. And I decided to just bundle them together and see if I can get rid of them. So someone purchased this six sample set for $10. After fees, I made $7.05. On February the 1st, I had a no sales day. On February the 2nd, I sold these Calvin Klein beige patent leather heels, size seven and a half. These sold on Poshmark for $20. After fees, I made $16. These I got at the very beginning of my reselling, reselling journey. I wouldn't pick these up again. They took forever to sell. I didn't really get much attention. I got these at a local Goodwill for $4. Next, I sold this Kate Spade blue stamped dot Blair flare skirt in a size 10. It also sold on Poshmark for $42. After fees, I made $33.60. I got this in a thread up bulk 100 pound rescue box. My cost of goods was $2.33. Next was another sale on Poshmark were these LEI Ashley low rise crop pants. These were mine personally. Um, they sold for $10. After fees, I made $7.05. On February the 3rd, another sale on Poshmark were these free people brown linen blend embroidered shorts in a size two. These sold for $19. I did give a shipping discount. So after fees, I made $13.08 and my cost of goods was $1.40 and I got these at a local clothes mentor. Next, another sale on Poshmark was this Men's Uniqlo Museum of Fine Arts of Boston collab tee in a size small. This sold for $20 after fees. I made $16. This actually came from a uh, men's thread up rescue box and my cost of goods was $3.67. Next was a, uh, my, actually my very first sale on Posh, not Poshmark, on eBay. And it was this loft gray merino wool blend cardigan in a size extra, extra small petite. This sold for $15 after fees, I think. It's kind of hard to figure out your fees on eBay. I think after fees, I made $13.07. I did see that once you buy your shipping label, you do make a little bit more on the sale because they give you a discounted rate on the shipping label. Um, so I don't really know what the percentage is when it's all said and done. So, but anyway. This also came from uh, that thread up bulk 100 pound uh, rescue box 
cost of goods again was two dollars and 33 cents on February 3rd was another no sales day. February the 5th, another Poshmark sale of this Columbia uh, Titanium Omni Shade Top in a size small. Again, this came from a long time ago. One of the first things that I ever bought to resale. Um, sold for $15. After fees, I made $12. And this came from a local Salvation Army. My cost of goods was $2.50. On February the, the 6th was another Poshmark sale. Um, these uh, khaki pants were my son's. Um, it was a set of two children's place khaki chino pants in a size 16. And I sold these for $15 and I made $12. Next was another Poshmark sale. This was a pair of Corky's Michelle black leather ankle boots in a size 7. These sold for $82 at my full asking price. After fees, I made $65.60. And these came from a recent Thread Up She Rescue box. And my cost of goods came out to be like $6.69 because I didn't keep every pair of shoes in that box. I didn't list them all. So I just average out my cost with how many shoes that I'm actually going to list. So that came out to $6.69. So that was all of my sales for the first week of February, which wasn't terrible, but um, before I had knee surgery, I, I was doing a lot better than that, and I hope to soon get up to where I was before. So my um, gross sales was $2, $2, oh man, was $248. So my net earnings was $195.45 after all of my fees. Um, so that was all for this week. I hope you enjoyed this and thank you so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, reselling content, unboxings, what sold videos, things like that, please think about subscribing and hitting that like button if you enjoyed the video. So thanks for watching.